Nancy and the Pixies. In the olden days, long before washing machines were invented, there were washermen and women who would come to your home and collect your dirty clothes to clean them for you. Nancy never did just that, rain or shine. She would walk over hill and moor to pick up clothes that needed washing and return them crisp, clean and neatly folded. Nancy worked long hours, but she liked her job and she never complained. The only thing that made her grumble was how much her husband worried when she walked home in the dark. Every day he would say, be careful of the pixies, make sure they don't try to lead you away to fairyland. And if she came home late, she would say, thank goodness you are home. I thought the pixies had got you. Nancy would touch pixies. Indeed, in all these years, I never see one and if I did, I wouldn't be afraid. Sometimes her customers worry too. Are you sure we can't take you home the carriage? They would ask. The pixies are out of this time of night and you don't want to visit Avi. Are you scared? Scared? Nancy would say. Not one bit. I have never seen a pixie and if I do, I can take care of myself. Compared to her family, neighbors and customers, Nancy was fearless when it came to pixies. One evening at sunset, Nancy had delivered her last bundle of washing and was about to set off for home when her customer said, Thank you, Nancy. Be careful on the way home. It's a perfect evening for mischief. Don't let the pixies let you away. Nancy was in high spirits. Pixies? What nonsense! She laughed. I've never seen one and until I do, I don't even believe they exist. Pixies, indeed.